Today, we're going to look at our chicken clock waddle piece of music, okay? You can use this as a warm up or you can use it as a full piece of music, that's up to you. I can talk it through with you on the board, but obviously we don't have that luxury. So we start off with four bars rest and we have to count those in a really specific way. We have one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, four. The second bit we have is B, B, A, G, A. We do that pattern three times and then we do a really long B at the end. Hopefully it should sound a little bit like this. Pause the video and have a practice. The next bit of the piece, we have exactly the same, B, B, A, G, A, but then we finish with a G this time. Let's have a listen. The next section we have, we have G, 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 A, G, 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 A, A, B. Okay, remember that we have rests, have a listen and then pause the video and it will be your turn. Have a listen with the rest. 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 Okay, this is the tricky bit. Okay, have a listen. Remember you've got that A, G, A, G, which is the same as we had at the beginning. We then have our very last section, B, B, A, G, A, G. Remember that G is four beats at the end. Here's the piece of music as a whole, now you've had a practice, off you go and I'll see you next week.